Hello, Sagittarius. Thank you, everybody, for tuning back in. All right, I really appreciate it. So let's get some messages for my beautiful Sagittarius today. All right, so let's see what is the important message for Sagittarius. So we got the Three of Cups here with the Ten of Pentacles. So there's a lot of people here. So you could be going to maybe like a celebration, Sagittarius. It could be like maybe a family reunion or a baby shower or a gathering. All right, but something is significant here about a third or this this group, okay? Yeah, we have the seven of wands. So it looks like what's the three of cups? It looks like this group of friends or these there could be like two women or three women or two men or three men. Yeah, we have the tower card. Okay. It seems like they are trying to do something that's gonna like something is gonna the tower is going to happen, but the seven of wands is standing right in front of the tower. So something could be possibly, it's going to fall back on this three of cups. Something is going to happen where it's going to fall back on the three of cups energy. This could be like friends or siblings or uh, this could be a group of people who, because you're not nowhere here. So this could be going on behind your back maybe here. So we have the empress here. So that could be a Libra in an Aquarius or somebody like that that's involved with something like that or... This is um, a Capricorn, Aquarius, and a Libra, or this is three people. <clears throat> I feel like this is someone's mother and maybe their daughter, or this is someone's grandmother, or this is someone's mother and, 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 their, and their sister or something like that. All right, so it's something happening. Give me one more on this three of cups in this empress. So, yeah, we have the ace of wands. Okay, okay. And the Queen of Swords and the King of Cups and the Four of Pentacles. So it seems like that all these people have came up with an idea. It could be one male that's involved, don't have to be. This could just be a water sign, female that's in her masculine energy. Like I said, or this could just be all male energy. But they, there's a group here. Okay, there's a group. I feel like there's a mother involved or something like that. But all these people have come up with some sort of idea with the Ace of Wands. Okay, but it seems like once they decide to take action with the Ace of Wands with this idea, it's going to backfire on them. What is this Ace of Wands? What, what are these people trying to do here? What is this idea? So we have the Eight of Pentacles and the Hermit. So it seems like someone is trying, the idea of the, the Virgo could be significant in this too. But it seems like the idea is to, or they, they are planning to work on something behind the scenes or to build on something or to focus on something or this is what they're doing. They're focused, you know, three of pentacles. There's definitely some sort of collaboration here that's happening. All these people could be family or there could be like two people, two out of these three could be in a relationship maybe, okay, with the two of cups. But it seems like whatever they are trying to plan, they are going in circles about it, okay? What What is, what is the um, three of pentacles? The nine of pentacles, the nine of wands. It seems like it's hard to catch you off guard due to the fact that you are a free spirit, or it's hard to get you in the eight of swords energy, energy due to the fact that you are very independent. You usually take care of your own business. You don't depend on someone else here. All right. So I don't. And then this don't have to necessarily be. It seems like if this is like a friend. Okay, because so this, this is what I'm getting, though. For some of you, if you are just not started talking to someone and you're talking to somebody new, I feel like this this is, like, maybe their, their... So, let's just say, boom, if you are a female, okay, a female fire sign, and you are talking to a male water sign, I feel like his earth, sus, earth sign sister and the mother is trying to figure something out. Like, they're going in circles to see if you are really... If you are the right person for someone, it just seems like three people trying to do their research or background or they are trying to get together to work on something to see something here. Okay, but it seems like they're going in circles. We do have the moon card, okay, the moon card and the queen of wands, okay. I feel like something could be hidden from you, Sage, because it seems like you are totally faced away from the moon card. Okay, now maybe you just don't care about this. This is something you don't really too much care about. But I do feel like three people are trying to look into you to figure you out or to try to figure something out regarding maybe your house, what you got going on, where you're staying there now with the um, the four of wands. Okay, there could be something significant with the Taurus 
or a Capricorn or an air sign, but I do see some that someone could be actually the King of Swords and the Emperor and the Hermit. Hierophant. Someone could be potentially even, you know, abusing their power. So somebody works in a field where they are able to be nosy in the sorts. All right, somebody is working in a field where they are able to see something, okay? So with the Seven of Swords, I do feel like somebody could be using their job or their position with the King of Swords and the Hierophant in a very negative way here with the Velvet Cord. But um, it's just them trying to be nosy or see what's up. I just feel like people, somebody is just... They're just curious what like these people are, or where's my Sagittarius energy? So we have the Eight of Cups. So we have the Eight of Cups for you, Sage, and the Hangman and the Page of Swords. So I feel like you have walked away because you have you started to look at something. You left a certain situation. You left from being stuck. If somebody's trying to figure out maybe why you're not stuck. Or you left from waiting, you're not waiting on somebody, or you seem like you are very enlightened. Somebody is very, these people are curious about you. The Page of Swords is also energy being very curious, okay? So it just seems like you're dealing with maybe someone or a certain situation, or you're dealing with, with people who are curious about you, or you in this community, maybe you just moved to a new neighborhood, and you you, you have this, this community of people just very curious about you. They really... They are nosy. Maybe you are very to yourself with the King of Swords here. Okay, maybe you moved along. Okay, in this neighborhood, the people are just curious now. If this is a new job here, okay, I feel like these people are just, they are, they're just three people that are just talking. They're gossiping, just trying to figure something out here. All right, Sage. I, I feel like that you, maybe you are, you give this energy out. You are giving in the energy of the two swords and the four of cups, which is somebody who just seems very disinterested or maybe cold or somebody who just don't, you know, who are not very friendly. Although you might be very friendly, okay? Although you might actually be real friendly or some of you are. Some of you are not. King of swords and the queen of swords is out here. Okay, but it seems like you, people, these people are wondering about you. You're coming off too mysterious or you're coming off as somebody who is just like... You're hiding something. You're coming off like you're hiding something. And you're not. Alright. So give me something for Sagittarius. So we have change. It says, I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. Okay. So I'm not sure where that is goes at all right and then we also have growth so it seems like these people just need to grow up and just accept this the change that's happening or maybe the fact that whatever you're coming in is, is causing a major change okay or what the energy that you're in is causing the change i have we have guilt here i release any beliefs that no longer exist in my soul's growth okay plus we have growth so something is definitely significant about growing okay i do see these people are do feel kind of weird or they feel all for even like looking into your life or trying to be nosy whoever these energies are okay sage but that's what i have for you my love and i'll see you in the next video bye